Hi, my name is Amanda, and I'm one of the pastors at Redeemer Lutheran Church, and welcome to Bedtime Bible Stories. I'm glad that you're here with us. If you have one, go grab one of your Spark Story Bibles so that you can follow along with our story for tonight. Today we'll read a story on page 394, and it's called A Seed of Faith. Jesus and the disciples were walking near a grove of huge mulberry trees. They wanted to be better followers of Jesus. Give us more faith, they asked Jesus. Jesus pointed to the largest tree in the grove and said, Do you see that huge tree? Then he pointed to a teeny dot on the ground. Do you see this little mustard seed? His friends crowded together to see the tiny seed. Jesus told them, If you have faith the size of this tiny mustard seed, you could say to that huge mulberry tree, Move into the sea, and it would. The disciples were confused. Jesus said, God gives you all the faith you need. All you can do is say yes to the faith God writes on your heart. This story kind of gets confusing because Jesus is talking about seeds and trees and faith and how it all fits together. I think part of it might be that when we plant seeds, those seeds have the opportunity to grow and become something so much bigger. And I think that that's a little bit how faith might work. We have faith inside of us that God puts there. And there are people in our lives that, that help water it and give it sunlight and help it grow. So maybe they take us to church. Maybe they read us Bible stories. Maybe they pray with us or pray for us. And they show us what it looks like to serve other people. And I think all of those people help our faith grow into something so much bigger than just that tiny little seed. And what's really amazing is that as somebody has helped us grow in our faith, we can also help somebody else grow in their faith too. We can all help each other water and give sunlight and support each other's growing in faith. Let's pray together. Dear God, thank you for all the plants and all the seeds all over the world. Thank you for giving us water and sunlight so they can grow. Thank you for planting seeds of faith in us and giving us people around us to help our faith grow. God, be with us always and help us to water and give sun and help other people grow in their faith too. And all God's children said, Amen. I'm so glad that you joined us for Bedtime Bible Stories tonight. I hope you'll join us again next Monday when we read another story. And always, 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 always remember that you are a loved child of God.